coffee, the way the speed is increasing. So let's wait and see the maximum speed that it will get, maybe within one or two minutes. And this is upside. Nice, now you're already with 200. So it's now, it's uh, 220, 225 kilometer per hour. At final time, you know, now when you reach this water here. Yeah. The front within like 100 meters, that's the final the terminal, the final terminal for Pudong International Airport. See the way it is nice, beautiful, clean, and the airport is here. So now we are at the terminal, uh, Pudong International Airport, and we are going to take Magdalene. The sign is here for people who want to take maglev, people who want to take coach. This is the sign. So we have to follow and see our first time experience taking the fastest train in China, maglev. So this is the way. We have to move straight and then that's where we're going to get, we're going to get maglev. While we are here, this is the entrance for Madeleine. We paid, uh, we paid 50 RMB. They will get, they gave us the card. They say, in case you have a flight today, they can give you discount. You pay 40 RMB for one way. If you want two, two ways, round trip. 80 LMB, but for me, because I just want one way, then I will take a uh, metro. So I paid 50 LMB, they gave me this card. So now I have to wait for it. This is this like a waiting area. And then soon we are going to see the way it's going to be. But they say in China, here in Shanghai, the maximum speed, the, you know, the constant speed for this maglev is usually 300. But you know, it can even go above 500. So let's go, let's experience maglev in China. Let's see this the maglev in China, how it's going to be. We are in Shanghai. So now it's time to go to get our maglev. So all people here. We are going in the same direction. So here there is platform A, platform B. But you just like, when they give you the pass, maglev pass, you can just sit anywhere you want. It's like a metro. But this is faster than metro, so let's go and see how it's going to be. Our maglev is here. Guys, are you ready? Are you ready to explore this fastest train in the world in China? This is maglev. <laughs> I wanna go, I wanna record a bit faster. This is the way it is. Shanghai Lapid Trans Rapid. So we are finally, we are going to board Maglev. This is Maglev, fastest train in the world. So this is the entrance.
this is the way it is. It's like a train. This way you can put your luggage. And that there are many like a compartments. You can sit anywhere you want. And that's how it is. Sorry. Yeah, so the good thing of this Maghreb, you can just sit anywhere you want and there is nice, not, like enough space in case you have luggage when you want to put somewhere. So for us, uh, I don't know where we are going to sit, but let's continue. Let's continue exploring until we get somewhere maybe free, then we can take the seat. Okay, maybe we just take this seat. No, okay, I think it's better we sit in front where we can be monitoring the speed of this Maghreb. And then I think this is better. So, <laughs> now we are in Shanghai and we are going to experience this the first hand experience of taking maglev in Shanghai with only 50 NB 50 NB is around 7 bucks 7 bucks you can take this maglev and in case you want like a round trip you just have to pay 80 which is around 11 11 bucks perfect affordable nice so now I feel like they are closing it's time to go So let's see how it moves, like uh, the speed. You see, it's moving from one. Now it's like within a few seconds, we are already on 50 kilometer per hour. See, the way the speed is increasing. So let's wait and see the maximum speed that it will get, maybe within one or two minutes. And this is outside. Nice, now you are already on 200. So you see now it's uh, 220, 205 kilometer per hour. Two fifty, man. We just within just one minute or two minutes, we are already going to fifty. I can feel it. Like the more it increasing the speed, I can feel the way. Like underground, I can feel the way it's like just moving faster. You can feel it. And now we have two hundred ninety and five. Holy shit! Three hundred. And look at look at this one. Look at outside. I mean, it's moving on three hundred. It's completely different from our uh, high speed trains because this one on 300 when it's moving you can feel that it's moving it's, even if you are walking like if you are walking around you can just feel like it's shaking a bit and when another one pass <laughs> you just feel like it's about it's like as if they are going to ride but this is the way it is outside when you are having like a, this maglev 300 km per hour this is Shanghai, this is China. So if you are coming to Shanghai, don't forget to try this maglev. Look at outside, look the way it's moving. <laughs> this is an amazing experience. It's my first time to take that maglev. 
but I think it's completely different. The experience you feel, the mood you get, it's like when you are taking the smuggler, you can never compare this one with a high speed train or anything. This is a unique experience that you, I wish you can try if you are coming to Shanghai. You see the way it's like a bit like, you know, shaking, shaking. What an amazing experience of today. You see that the way it's like a mountain, it's like now we are turning. When I turn around, I feel like as if it's going to flip. <laughs> but we are already heading to the city. I can see the route as well. It's not far from here. You see, let me show you guys what I'm saying. You see where I am, and you see that guy. You see, it's not, it's not flat. It's like as if we are bending on my side, like this, like my grave is bending on my side. So, and down, it's like we are using a highway. So, <laughs> one second, you feel like what if it can flip down and you know, fall down because you don't see anything here. Within like a few minutes, I feel like we use only like five, it's no more than five minutes, five or ten. You know, now we are already at the corner station. This is a, a long, long yen station. So from here, you can just take metro to go to all other places you want, or if you want, you just go back to where we came, the other side where we came from. We finally outside. This is the best experience of today. I believe. And uh, now, some people come, they can go to the other side to take to go back, or they will just take metro to go around. It's, you know, sometimes you can just take it because maybe you want to go somewhere so fast, or maybe because you want to feel the experience of mag level, you know. But it was the best one. I can recommend anyone to say, if you are in Shanghai, come and try this mag level. We are at one famous route judge, eh? it's where, uh, in the case you are in Shanghai and you want to go to the tourist buildings in China, this is the station. So we are going outside, we are going to see how it looks like during the daytime because and here in China you just pay with value pay for exit. After using the metro you pay with uh, your phone and you are done. So now we have to go outside. Here I'm not sure is the most famous museum here, Art Museum of Shanghai. You see the way there are a lot of people here? These people, some are just for this museum, others for this tower, Shanghai Tower. Like Shanghai Tower is within 100, like 100 meters. So if you are coming to Shanghai, do just in the case you took, uh, in the case you will take train, I mean metro, that's the station. But again, you can take the like, taxi, very affordable, and this is the place. You just come to the center, I come to see. This is the, the tower and the near the tower. That's where is the tourist building. And here, that's the tower. In front of me, that's the tourist building in Shanghai. In China, actually. We, let's go up so we can be able to film this tourist building in Isway.
nice sunny nice temperature today in Shanghai and now it's already 1 p.m. Yeah. When you say shushu, it's like angkwa, you know, like for old people in China, you just say shushu, you know. Uh, so we are finally here. Look at this beauty here. Look at this beauty. Let's just see the way there are a lot of people here. The way there are a lot of tourists. You know, we are still celebrating Chinese national holiday. So there are a lot of Chinese here coming with us to maybe for the first time. If they are first time in Shanghai, or they say, oh, want to come to this Ruza Jue. Say, Ruza Jue. <laughs> so, nice place. You can just come here if you want to take photos. You can go to this IFC mall in case you want to maybe get food, shopping, drinks. And I'm still impressed with this, like this place here, you know, you can spend a whole day here exploring and you never get tired. You see, like we came from Hudong, it's from Maglev, coming to this Ruza Dre. The beauty of this place, amazing. People, a lot of people everywhere. And this side, like here, that's where you get to the Shanghai Tower. You see? Behind, these are tourist buildings here. This side is just Shanghai Tower. Everything is just one place.